many a story had been told round the bonfire. A fire of passion deep down inside. Regret and tears I cannot hide. But I have a fire burns round me. Oh, but those are the fans. I don't need dreams. <laughs> hi. Okay, so fight. hi. This is Lisa Coppola, and I am here with Anne Marie Cerno. Hello. Say hello. Jimmy Parker. Hi, how are you? I'm Bob. <laughs> Bob McGilpin. And so we're getting ready to start a session, and we're going to be going inside, but I just wanted to introduce you to everybody. Oh, I wanted to introduce the best storyteller that I know, singer-songwriter, Benny Pitt singer from Huntsville, Alabama. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Very welcome. And I will introduce the guy that writes the music that puts my stories, to makes people's feet tap to my stories, Mr. Steve Owen. Thank you. I'm glad to be here, and I tell you, Benny, it was an honor to be part of Bonfire. Oh man, that studio was just full of stars. It was, wasn't it? I mean, it was, we got there. It was me, and you, <laughs> me, me and you and Jimmy Parker in the same booth. You know, what what else can we say? Uh, it's burning in me. It's burning. No, you know, she just she said she wanted somebody with the voice of a growly grizzly bear at <laughs> the first of the song. And she got it. So she got it, I guess. <laughs> Even though Jimmy certainly had a much better voice. <laughs> but, well, you know. And uh, but anyway, of Lisa was there. No, Lisa, Lisa, Lisa was there. Lisa, Lisa was really good. She did, a great, she did a great harmony for, yeah. through the whole song almost. Oh, yeah. 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 And then Anne Marie, of course, you know, great songwriter, great singer, and a great entertainer. And, um, you know, I can't wait till it comes out. Me either. I think, I yeah. think it's going to do well. Hello, everybody. This is Doc G. And I want to comment about the, the song Bonfire. Uh, Anne Marie and I actually uh, created that song based on uh, how indies feel about uh, their situation as they start growing. Um, their music starts getting noticed more. Um, so it alludes to Bonfire being a burning inside all of us um, that we feel and also that it must uh, it must do a lot of different things. In other words, the flame gets higher in a bonfire. The flame grows in a bonfire. Uh, people feel the energetic feeling of the universe around them, surrounding them, and making them feel wonderful. And it just what happens is it, it goes, if you watch a bonfire, if a piece of wood gets caught on fire, then another piece of wood gets caught on fire. So the bonfire creates more of the same. And, and that unique energy is built up around all the indie artists that feel that flame. I have no one to introduce me, so I will introduce myself. I am Donna Jo. Um, this is Peggy. Uh, she asked me to join on the song Bonfire, which is a beautiful song. Um, a positive message for everyone coming together. The world can feel like a rat race, as we were talking. And sometimes music, um, it has a way of helping you to forget the reality of what is and gives you hope for what can be and it gives you a memory of what was and anyway bonfire is such a beautiful song and she wanted me to bring some gospel at the end of that song and i am so glad that she and it's all of us together sharing in a song a single But anyway, it, um, we were all going through quite a bit. I had just lost my dog, Cosmo. He was almost 12 and he passed away. And then I got sick and had shingles at 33. 
But I think it's just, um, you know, the rat race and dealing with that death of my best friend. So for me, um, it was a difficult time. But I was so honored that she wanted me to be part of this song, Bonfire. So, uh, anyway, thank you, Anne Marie. You are a great songwriter, friend, singer, entertainer, and you always understand me when sometimes I don't even understand. Bonfire's lit, burning desire. There's no accidents in life. We'll keep the sun. I am Jimmy Parker, national recording artist from Nashville, Tennessee. Um, I just want to send out a lot of thanks to Anne-Marie Paserno for uh, allowing me to be a small, minute portion of her new single that will be coming out called Bonfire. Um, she called me up and asked me if I would come in and sing on the track, and I went to the studio that day, and I did about one or two, maybe two small lines at the most, and uh, a couple of ahs and oohs and uhs, like, but no, not really, but... Uh, Anyway, um, it was such a pleasure to be a part of it. Met some great people. I uh, met Steve and Benny and uh, Bob and and uh, Donna Joe uh, and all of it, just some really really great musical creative and talented people. Oh, I also met Lisa Coppola. How could I forget her? <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> She's going to Oh yeah, it's, it's hard work being a famous studio recording star. Yeah. And it's, it's very impressive to work with, with people that are, you know, pros and really put their heart into it and are not just going through the motions. It's, it's, it, it's, it, you guys make it look easy. It's not easy. It's fun when I get to put all the parts together. And then listen back and, and, and hear what everybody's love and energy did to the song. It's just it's freaking amazing. And I thank all okay. the independent artists out there that struggle every day to get their music heard, whether it's in a venue, a radio station, or anywhere. And I hope I, I can succeed in making that happen for you more and more every day and also bringing that bonfire to light. Sing a song.